Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of Chromebook Tips and Tricks video and I'll show you how to log into your Chromebook without a password. If this is your first time or repeat visit, thank you for your support. On this hybrid channel, I'm always trying new and different ideas to take you beyond boundaries. If you're into thinking outside the box, this is the channel for you. If you're looking for more Chromebook Tips and Tricks videos, there'll be links in the description box below. So let me clarify that by without the password, I didn't mean that you know you don't have to enter anything you are still uh, going to require enter a pin number uh, the difference is that you're not going to enter a lengthy or hard to remember password uh, so you can choose a pin uh, or id which is very easy to remember and that's what i'll show you today so if you have your chromebook uh, open then the first thing you're going to do you're going to go to settings and which is going to be right here where the clock is so if you just you know click on the clock and then you're going to click on the cogwheel button or the settings which is right here so let's click on that so now this is going to take you to your settings screen and then you're going to look on the left side of your device and you're looking for device so which is going to be right underneath the account so if you're uh, watching this video down the road many years later and if you don't find the device right here uh, just look for it it may be it may be somewhere else but this is where you're going to click on device so just click on it and then if you see here then you're going to just you know scroll down a little bit and you're looking for let's take a look here security and privacy which is right there and then you're looking for lock screen and sign in password only that section so now you can see that you know right now it's set to open only using password and we're going to change it to pin from password so you're going to just click on this tiny arrow right here so if you click on it so now first thing it's going to ask you to enter your password so i'm going to have to enter your password so just to block my password i'm just going to show you my uh, card uh, which is like you know right here uh, it has a uh, QR code and if you want to subscribe you can just click on it so I'm just going to you know enter the password so give me a few seconds here okay so I entered my password so let's hit confirm hopefully I entered the right password okay so it looks like I entered the right one so now we can see that it's giving you the pin option which is right here so you're going to switch the pin from password so if you just click here and it's asking you to set up pin so the one thing is that you have to you know choose the pin to be a six digit number so I'm just going to you know choose one two three four five six just to show you so let's choose one two three four five six and if you hit continue now you have to just you know confirm your pin so let's choose again one two three four five six and if you hit confirm again so now you have changed your uh, chromebook login screen or sign in screen so what i'll do i'll just quickly restart the computer actually i'm sorry if i restart this i think this is going to you know start uploading some uh, updates so i'm just going to like you know close it uh, or i'm just going to uh, close it and open it and that should prompt me to enter the password and then let's see what happens so if i just reopen it okay see now you can see that you know it's not asking me to enter the password again so when you turn on your computer uh, after shutting down you're going to get the same screen and then what you have to do you have to just you know one two three four five six and you're going to just you know go back to your crumble so you don't have to enter the password anymore every time you start or open or log into your Chromebook so this is how you change your uh, Chromebook from password to pin uh, just another note that uh, changing this device doesn't mean that you know this is going to change for all your devices so this would apply only to the device you are changing it to so for more tips and tricks videos I'll, I'm going to put a link on the screen and I'll see you in the next video thank you for watching